Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy Explorers, where we are playing through in multiplayer. I'm your host, Redmond Stash, and these guys are my friends. Hello. And today, Hello. we're going to be right now. going to do a job aptitude exam thing. And not Bahamut. Yes, not that. Oh, we have to defeat one behemoth king. Oh, my explosive fist with where's combo factor seven. And thankfully, behemoths traditionally do not fly. Traditionally. Yeah, I actually think uh, the, the best uh, boss that they've had in this game, I like Ifrit a lot. I thought uh, Amaterasu was pretty fun. Yeah, Amaterasu was pretty, cool. was pretty interesting, though very lasery. Yeah, well, it's kind of, Amaterasu is like the effect, in my opinion, the effective final boss because, I mean... Because it was actually plot related? It was plot relevant and it had like text on the screen like, oh, are you the chosen one yeah. kind of stuff. And the mechanics were interesting and it was interactable at all times. So there was lots of things on the screen to hit. You could hit the, yeah. the power-up orbs. Uh, the breakables are on its sides that are moving around a little bit, but you could like discreetly target them and break them so they would be less lasery. Like it was like this is actually like a good fight. Like if all the fights are like this, I like it. Or like um Ifrit in his simplicity yeah. was just great because all of the attacks had very clear telegraphs. They were and all also, very fair. These and two these bosses we're talking about are both on the ground the entire time. And neither of them had an instant death move. Uh, standing in Hellfire was basically instant death. Uh, except Hellfire, it was a bunch of little spouts. If you didn't get hit by a bunch of them, you would live. Yeah, I mean, you, you'd have to take one directly to the dick, and and then if that happened, you're dead. But yeah, How have I been ready up this entire time? Uh, I thought Shiva was the first like fight yeah. that they had a mechanic that was bull. Yeah, she had her laser that was just, hey, if you're in it, you're dead. Uh, no, she actually had a she has a combo that she can just decide. Yeah, she freezes you and then lasers you. Uh, it's the double sweep kick into the uh, sh sh throwback tornado. She can fire her laser into that when you cannot interact with the yeah. game. Yeah, and you're just dead. Hey, Josh, you want to join the quest? I do. Then maybe you should. Don't judge me. Oh, I'm judging you. All right, off we go. Oh, we, we just got to go just outside. And it's to our right. Ooh, it's big. Yeah, he's big. Also, there are some goblins over here we can kill for goblin horns. Uh, they probably give freaking belts. But I mean, this one has clearly decided to submit himself to my blade. So apparently, this behemoth kills the frame rate more than Bahamut did. Probably because everyone can actually hit him. <laughs> oh, I got a goblin horn. I can actually change my chest. If I get oh, two Lord. more goblin horns, I can actually get a full set of matching armor. I love top form. I have to say, it's one of my favorite things to get because it makes all my spells do tons of damage because I'm usually full home. It's something about being able to control my own health pool. Yeah. I'm gonna drop this on top of David to give him some of that love. Oh man. He's gaining health. Hey, he has a, he has a uh, drain move. Oh, I'm I'm low on thing. Uh, see if you're still on cooldown. Man, 
man, this is like way better than Bahamut. <laughs> <laughs> that was refreshing. Uh, that wasn't an 18 minute long fight where, my, where two of our friends couldn't hit him and everyone was dying. There's another goblin who might have a horn. I find it interesting that the goblins I have to kill are the garbage hey, goblins. Hey, he gave me a horn. Like, the high level goblins, they drop belts instead of horns, whereas these guys, they can give horns. Not one of these goblins has had a purple drop for me. Yeah, me either. Kind of makes me want to switch over to Thief. Got good, good deeps. And oh, Aww, he died right as the thing went to black. Womp womp. Maybe I'll switch to Sage. What do we unlock? Sage and who? Dragoon. Uh, Dragoon? Sounds like it's going to be a good class, and then isn't. Mm. It's not? Does it not get jump? Oh, no, it gets jump. Jump's just bad. But is it good against monsters that you otherwise can't hit because they're flying three <laughs> feet off the ground? Oh. You might have a point there. <laughs> it's like, actually, Dragoon's the best melee class. <laughs> uh, no, uh, in my opinion, the best uh, damaging melee class that is early unlocked, or at least unlocked for us right now, is Dark Knight. Because all of their abilities are great. I thought triggers are just supposed to be like a vers versatility. Yeah, Lots. they are more versatility. Lancet is an interesting passive. They get um, HP and AP. They get extra HP and AP uh, when they basic attack things. But all their abilities are kind of like worse sword moves. <laughs> like it's, it's really not inspiring. Their, their stuff is really not inspiring. Um, also, they get a deflect alike. But, so, Pete, imagine deflect, Explore. except instead of preventing all damage, it prevents half the damage. Mm. That's, 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 all, that's it. Still kind of nice. That's, that's the only thing. I mean, it's, it's nice, but compared anybody, to deflect? Anybody else here still using pendant? Uh, yeah. I might be. Nope. So, I see we've got another Bahamut quest. Oh boy, let's Let, not. Let's do a Great Malboro. <laughs> let's not. Let's not, and just never. Let's do anything except Bahamut. But it unlocks the legendary spear. I respect that opinion. And, and you're I've going got, to have it. I've got a new chest now. It's basically a recolor. Hey. It's at least less clashy. Yeah, I, I got I got this quest up for us. I will be joining it in a moment. I was gonna really quickly learn every skill I haven't learned yet. You can do that between episodes. I do it right now too. Yeah, but then the viewers get to watch you and your exciting menu-based gameplay that I can't even see. Like, I can't even see my own touch screen on this thing. I, I definitely can't see yours. What are we fighting in this one? Uh, a great what Malboro. Are we, what am I fighting for? We are fighting a great Malboro. You know, Pete, I did all of that, and I'm still the first person to join in in preparations, so... Yeah. I'm here. All right, let's go to the wherever this is. Okay, it's it's off in Dryad Town. Really? Yeah. God damn it. But at least it won't have Dryad. <laughs> at least it won't have Bahamut. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> the, the the level for boss we hate has been in, in extremely increased. Yeah, I there's a see. lot of things it won't have. Hey, Adam, I can see that you have, like, a Venus flytrap for a weapon. I can see that, whoa, everybody's gone. It makes me sad that goblin guards are too high level to have horns. Why is a belt 
more valuable than a horn game. Well, this is a Final Fantasy game. Belts are like the most important commodity in this universe. <laughs> he has you there. Yeah. I mean, they can function as any piece of clothing. <laughs> as pain would would show you from uh, X2, they can function also as every piece of clothing. Yeah. And it's not Final Fantasy, though it might as well be. And Bravely Default, the vampire class, also shows you that belts can be every piece of clothing. <laughs> I like Bravely Default, except for the repeating part. Yeah, hopefully uh, Bravely Second, which comes out, I think, next I month. never really, like, got super into it. I have a lot, a, lot, a lot of friends who really liked it, but for me, I just basically got told that you have to grind up the city or you fail at the game, and I was like, I don't really have interest in that. Yeah, but there's no grinding. Yeah, you grinding like up the city is tell it to do a thing overnight. Yeah, like you go to bed. And you wake up, oh, look, my city grinds It's like stuff. Eve level grinding. Yeah. Except, like, like short term. Yeah. Well, now I'll have to, I guess, dig up my copy. And it's got a sequel coming out, I think, like, next month. Hopefully yeah. that'll be better. That's... It's got, my, my favorite my, class was the one that used two shields. My budget as a college student living in Narnia uh, means that I'm not going to be buying that game next month. I'm probably going to be paying Tom Clancy's The Division. Yeah. And also, you bought this game. So, I mean... <laughs> it's partially my fault. <laughs> yeah, I just don't play uh, games on my threes very often. Yeah. I kind of, I, I would blame you, but I got a decent amount of play out of this game. But really, just my enjoyment sharply spiked down. Yeah, I know the feel. Like for this game specifically that we're playing right now. Yeah, yeah. does this game we, actually have like an ending? Do you beat it? Yeah. If we weren't shooting the shit here, I would not, not playing. be playing this. <laughs> yeah, that's. I kind of stopped playing. Yeah, I'm gonna and... call this like with friends, solid seven to eight out of ten. Alone, uh, like a four out of ten uh, game. Okay. Yeah, it's Triforce uh, Heroes, but Final Fantasy. I, I will take that a step farther. With friends, it's a six out of ten game. Uh, I don't agree with that because, well, I'm not rating the friends. I'm rating the gameplay. Uh, I don't. I, I, just, I, just, I, I don't agree with that. I, I believe that okay. it's I believe well, better than you can. You can. Day. You've definitely stated your own opinion. Yeah. So. You guys, we have differing opinions about video yeah. games. What will we do? Yeah, I know. But it's like, if you got people to play this game with, it's okay. I mean, when me and Josh were playing it together, that was pretty fun. Uh, except for all the parts where he sucked uh, because he picked a class that was not the greatest. And we really? had, and you had, we had the no lock on thing, so I couldn't lock on as an oh, archer. Oh, yeah. So imagine, imagine he was playing an archer, uh, but then, but we opened every quest with you can't lock on to enemies. So we fought Is all the that flying. Why he enemies. had such a, bar a problem with Phoenix while he was an archer? Yes. <laughs> why are there so many Malboros? Do they really want this game to run at two frames per second? <laughs> I don't want to be playing a PowerPoint here. Excuse me, PowerPoint has ten frames, has, has one frame per ten seconds. I'm being targeted by something. I don't think there's enough Malboros over there. Yeah, I, I don't think there are. Oh, hey, either. I've received every status effect possible. Hooray! So, I did, except for except for I could still cast. Yeah, I was I got paralyzed too. Oh, I see someone is Terra. Time to turn into something and then do things. Oh man, this frame rate. <laughs> Truly. Outrageous. Like, how does this happen? Monster Hunter runs so smoothly and then other games with much worse models on everything run like ass <laughs> anyway i don't think this game's that good uh it's it's but i think it's playable like the first time you're playing through it it's pretty playable but then if you get like oh, there's crap on the ground yeah well we killed like 80 malboros just incidentally yeah 
Oh man, Josh had unleashed Judgment Bolt there. That would have been hilarious. By hilarious, you mean would have lagged the game into crashing on four threes at <laughs> once. It would have been. Now, here we go. No, Josh, you should have dropped this like earlier when we it had. It didn't come up until after the quest was over. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Yeah, it's uh. Apparently, so transurgers can be assisted by people to last longer. Can they? Looks like it. Uh, when I have. The I activate, ones for the characters. But the ones for the. Uh. Idolans, you can. Ooh, I got a Malboro eyeball. Aren't you special? You would think you would get more than one with how many were in that damn quest. <laughs> <laughs> they got like ten eyes each. I didn't even get an eyeball, so, you know. Yeah. Subfeast updated. Can I, can I make anything, please? Like, I know I got a new chest, but... Yeah, no, I, I can't make anything, because I don't have the stuff. Well, that's going to be it for this episode. Join us next time when we do still more things. See you then, friends. Later. Bye, everybody. Bye.